Hello everyone, Neth is here with, uh, with Grunty and our curious friend Huimond here in Uldar. So let me, let me explain how we got here. This has been something I've been planning to do for a while, but let me explain how we actually got here today, specifically. Well, I sat down on my main to record uh, the Scholastica questline for patch 3.4, thinking that, you know, as we went, I'd probably remember everything that happened in the in the previous step and I'll be able to explain it as we went but uh, patch 3.1 was a really really long time ago that's a long long break in between you know episodes of of a fairly dense uh, storyline and I got about five minutes into recording uh, that second part of the Scholasticate and realized that I was completely lost and decided, hey, you know what, I don't think I ever recorded the first part, so why don't we go back and do that? Uh, because we ought to do that on one of my alts, right? Uh, wrong. <laughs> As it turns out, in order to unlock the first part of the Scholastic, you have to have done all of the A Realm Reborn Hildebrand quest lines. So that's what we're doing today. That's how we got here. And uh, that's what's going to happen. Why the hell not? The Rise and Fall of a Gentleman, patch 2.1. God, this takes us way back. Alright. You would have us help her. I think I know who her is. I oh, even busy as a bee, Grunty. Seems half of the whispers what come my way relate to your comings and goings. Being the active type you are, I reckon you'd be interested in investigating some queer rumours, am I right? But before that, let me ask, ever heard of a man named... Hildebrand. Oh. Oh no. Oh dear. Oh, you don't mean to say you knew the bugger. I thought he thought himself famous, but thinking it didn't make it true. Saying they had to go and get himself killed. All that nonsense about stopping Dullamud himself. What in the seven hells was he thinking? At least it was mercifully quick. Still judging from the depth of the crater, he must have fallen from an unfathomable height. Gods only know what's going through his mind as he watched the ground rush up to meet him. Ugh. Amazing how well the body was preserved, though. Hell, it's amazing there was a body left to bury at all. Hmm. I had a reason for bringing this up. Ah, right, so Nashu, Ildebrand's erstwhile assistant, has since become an inspector in her own right. At present, she's investigating the queer rumours I mentioned earlier. She's a sweet lass, a bit daft, but sweet nonetheless. So when I hear she's at wit's end, I want to help. Thing is, I prefer to meddle in the affairs of the living. The zombies are most definitely not my forte. So if you're willing, I'd be grateful if you lend her a hand. As for where to find her, she's like to visit Hildebrand's grave in the lichyard when she's frustrated. Try looking for her there first. Oh my, this is really, really taking me back. Well, here we go. Here we go, boys and girls. I guess we're in the deep end here now, aren't we? <laughs> I think it's going to be a little while before we get to do Scholastic yet. What a dreary scene. Well, time to meet old Nashu. Oh, if only you were still alive, Inspector. You know how to stop these zombies. Ah, you there. Could it be? You've come to offer your services to me. Uh, yeah, I have, actually. Oh, but where are my manners? Allow me to introduce myself. <clears throat> my name is Matthew, agent of inquiries, extraordinary inspector. <laughs> Wait, that's not right. That's not quite right, Matthew. At least that's what I'm trying to be. It's not quite as easy as he made it look. Inspector Hildebrand was a great man, a real Aorzian hero. We travelled the world, me and him, I think you mean him and I, Matthew, solving cases and thwarting evil. No matter the mystery, you could always count on the inspector to solve it with grace and style. <sighs> but then there was the final case. The case of the century, he called it. How to stop the red moon from destroying the world. To save us all, 
He flew into the sky and all I could do was watch. But then, then he came back down and he, he... Grunty just smiling. <laughs> oh shit, here we go. This is all a joke. A big funny joke. Right, Inspector? A moment now, you burst out of the ground and felt surprise had you fooled, eh? And and we'll laugh and laugh. That's a um That's a reference to Waiting for Gotto, I believe. Anyway, that's neither here nor there. Hildebrand Mandeville, beloved son. <laughs> they say, they say no one remembers the Warriors of Light. Their names, their faces, all gone forever. But I remember you, Inspector. No, the gentleman hero, Hildebrand. I can never be the hero you were, but I'll do my best to try. Did you just... Did she just pull them off his corpse? I, Matthew, Inspector Extraordinaire, will carry on your legacy. Hmm. <laughs> did she just... Did she just strip his corpse? Oh dear. So I tell myself, well, Matthew, there must be a leader, a head zombie, who tells the rest what to do. Therefore, all we need to do is kill him. Again, that is. Unfortunately, I don't know where he is or how to find him. But now that you're here, my faithful assistant, you can try the one good idea I've come up with so far. If you go where these dapper zombies were last seen in Southern Fallon, you might find them. And then you could, um... Ah, you could become their friend and ask to meet their leader. Yes, that's sure to work. <laughs> become their friend and ask to meet their leader? Really? I've never tried making friends with a zombie. But I don't see why it would be hard. Just moan, groan, pretend to be dead. That's, um... That's, uh... Got nothing to say about that, actually. <laughs> Alright, Southern Thanalan it is. Now, I'm, I'm a feeling I have to wait around for... Oh, I do have to wait around for a bloody fate to spawn here, don't I? Oh, bollocks. Now, I think it's... Yeah, it's going to be faster from F Forgotten Springs. Oh my god, I legitimately thought I was going to fall asleep there. So, um... <laughs> I've just been sitting here getting terrible flashbacks of the amount of bloody fates we had to wait for for side missions in, uh, in A Realm Reborn. But, finally... Finally, and that's right, I don't have to try Disaster at 50. Let's see if I can remember how to, uh, how to sum... How to do the sum... That's not going to hit him. Yes it is. Yay! Hooray! You're neither a gentleman nor a zombie! That's not very nice. Alright, I don't think I actually have to kill that many of them. So this shouldn't take too long. You're neither a gentleman nor a zombie! Oh. I feel so cultured, I feel so refined. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love it so much. You know, I'm taking note of the time here because I have like legitimately been waiting for about 25 minutes for this bloody fate to spawn, but uh, it's worth it. Absolutely worth. Alright. I guess I actually do have to... Uh, Take out quite a few of them, huh? Alright, well, we might skip through this as well then. Give me a moment. Alright, should be just this one left. 
Come here, gentle deadman. Be gone, villain! <laughs> Alright, and what do we pick up there? I gotta admit, I do feel kind of bad beating up the gentle deadman uh, in retrospect. Writ upon this map with the Sargoli deserts in a flamboyant flowing hand are the words that gentleman is rather than does. Well, I mean, apparently Hildebrand can read and write, and uh, <laughs> that's more than uh, many of us would expect of him, so you know what? Good for him. Good for Hildy. All right, Nashu, you'll never bloody believe this. Did you find the zombie? You did? That's wonderful. I've been busy too. The head zombie will rue the day he meets me, you'll see. So tell me, what did you learn? Well, I'm not sure whether it's a good idea to show you this, but I will. Oh, so you weren't able to make new friends. That's just... that's just shame. <laughs> Don't know why I struggle with that little phrase there. But this parchment, this is the map of the salt goalie desert. There's a spot marked here in the south, and look, there's something written here. A gentleman is, rather than does. That sort of reminds me of, uh, well, no matter. Let's see where this map takes us, assistant. Onward to the Sagoli. All right. Okay. All the way down there. Fine. All right, is this the spot now, Shu? I don't think I misread the map. Maybe they're just shy, though. I say we call out to them and let them know we come in peace. And when the leader throws himself, we strike. Uh... I mean... <laughs> Let's be real, what's gonna get their attention? Uh, uh, who summons the gentle dead men? They live, they live! Oh, that's a zombie voice, not Nashu. <laughs> they live, they live! And we, we hunger. My brothers, lend me your ears. A gentleman does not dine upon his guests. <laughs> what is he doing all the way up there? Spare this fine gentleman and fair lady your mastications. Withdraw, I say, and harass him no more. Up in the sky, look, it's a bird. No, it's an airship. No, it's the inspector. We hear and we obey. Oh, now suddenly they can run? Fucking get a load of this. <laughs> It hits you, it really hits you. I knew nothing could kill the great Inspector Hildebrand. Hildebrand? Who is this Hildebrand of whom you speak? My name is Zombiebrand, devourer of brains, undead overlord extraordinaire. What are you saying? You're not an undead overlord, you're a gentleman inspector. Uh, ins inspector, overlord, inspector, overlord. Oh, Inspector, you're just confused, is all. Don't worry, I'll knock some sense back into that noggin of yours. St stay your hand, my lady. You know no what, not what you do. You know not what you do. That's always been a difficult phrase. Even if I were the esteemed gentleman you purport me to be, the concussive force of the blast is more likely to liquefy my... If crashing into the ground made you forget, then an explosion of equal force ought to make you remember. That's science, ladies and gentlemen. I'll save you, Inspector, or kill you trying. See, even you acknowledge the possibility that this plan will result in my... <laughs> that face. Death. Oh. <laughs> oh, God.
Normally I would implore your ingenuity now, Shu, but I've preferred that you found a more elegant solution. Ah, oh, he remembers me. Inspector Hildebrand remembers me. Yes, yes, I remember you, my faithful assistant. What I do not quite remember is how I came to be here. Oh, here we go. Oh, I remember this. Oh, no. Ah, oh, such a wonderful dream. I slew a dragon and... Hmm. 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 What is this place? And for that matter, who am I? sees the zombies and he's like oh oh I see <laughs> hmm. it's all right pal you're with us now yeah yeah, there's some zombie stuff. Zombie stuff, you say? <laughs> I, Hildebrand, agent of inquiry. Inspector Extraordinaire have awoken at last. I... I wait for you to come back to us. Be it Red Moon or Black Dragon, no fiend is a match for my legendary might. Oh dear, that's a, uh... <laughs> oh my god, that's foreshadowing Nidhogg right back in 2.1. Oh man. And who might this fine gentleman be? Hmm. Could he be perhaps one of my many admire? Oh, but what is this faint tingling sensation in my arm? This ringing in my ears, this, this dizziness, could it be a case? <laughs> uh, wasting no time, all right. Okay, look, what do you think, Nashu? You should be happy now. Amazing, isn't it? He was dead. He wasn't dead, he was just badly injured, and needed to hibernate. I didn't even know people could do that. No, you or me neither. Uh, anyway, everyone. Like I say, I'm, I'm not quite sure how we ended up here. Well, I am, but I wasn't really expecting to be, to be here dealing with these Muppets today, but that's where we are. Um, I'm gonna leave it there for the moment, because, uh, I'm gonna try something a little bit different and cut these uh, into slightly smaller parts because I, I normally, when I record Hildebrand, I do a whole patch uh, at once and the episodes come out in about an hour and uh, I know that might be a little bit long for some people to consume in one sitting. So uh, let me know what you think below anyway. Uh, and uh, geez, I guess, uh, I guess we're here now. This is what we're doing. So <laughs> look forward to more of this and uh, I'll see you in the next part. Bye, bye-bye, bye. -bye. bye, -bye.